classic bag breaks we're back we've got a new intro video we we're working on we just got it keyed and queued up not sure if it worked or not but i hope it did Let's see if i can get everything here set up real quick ryan's not in here yet let me get my, make sure my chat's set up How's everybody doing tonight? Welcome. We're uh, we got we got one pack break so far. Nothing too fancy. Got a 2018 Bowman to break from Matt, and we're uh, we got a new intro video that we've been working on here the last couple of days. Might have to rewind it. Or I can show y'all again here in a minute. If I can get this chat to work. Shit. I was more worried about the, uh, about the intro, trying to get that right, and didn't even log into the. Hey Ryan. What's the problem? I don't know. I don't. I don't know how to use a computer. Hit that. Uh, make sure our chat's working in there. Well, it's not working if you're not logged in. Okay. That's what. That's what the computer guys for. Bang. I didn't think I didn't think you were uh what was that? It pushed up to the limit. Did you uh could you see it? happening chat is up all right that's it's it's like brain surgery but we got it are you gonna give it to him again the new uh vid check it out guys here's the new intro video classic pack race.com Um, What's up, dude? Are you ready to open some baseball cards? What? Are you ready to open baseball cards? Yeah? I'm not even going to do a video. I heard you. <laughs> I heard you talking. Like, you? blah, 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 blah. Did I say anything good yet? No. Not yet. He said you sounded creepy. Do I? <laughs> All right, well, the creep, like, creepy, creepy people are, are in the house. Where, you you check out these new cards that I got. Were you, you got it out of bank? Have you ever seen this? Yeah. Are they Star Wars? No, these are magic cards. These are new. Well, I wish I could have some of those. That, you can have some. Here they are. I got them today. You did? Yeah. These are cool. They're yours. Thanks. What do you Don't think? get them all over the house. Okay. What do you say? Thank you. You're welcome. It's a game. It's a game? Yeah, man, but I, somebody tried to explain it to me today, and yeah, even for big boys, it's not easy. 
Not at all. Okay, all right, here we go. Chat is up. Matt's in the house. What's up, buddy? Did you see our, uh, did you see the intro video? Did it come through? What, did it look right? I think on the phone? Was this thumbs up. Oh, okay, right on. Right on. Welcome to the party, guys. So what do you think? They're kind of cool, aren't they? Yeah. Check these out, guys. This I, I can't even get started to explain how this game. But these are some of the cards that are uh, some of the most fancy cards there are right here. Magic the Gathering. These are, uh, it's a game. It's a, it's a, it's a game, like a, like a game that you go to the, uh, like, little hangouts and play it at a table with, with a bunch of people and you have tournaments. It was, it was crazy. This guy tried to explain it to me today. Never in my whole life have I ever heard of something more crazy than that. But they're called Magic the Gathering. And they're pretty cool. And like, I guess here's how it works. Here's what I got out of the explanation for today. It said that uh, what you do is you buy them out of a pack. Like a regular pack of baseball cards. That's what I did today. I bought a couple of them. Just to see what they looked like. And just to kind of get an idea of what they were. And uh, what you do is you buy packs of them. And you assemble, you, you assemble your own deck of these cards. And then you go play in a tournament against other people that have assembled their own deck to counter your your deck basically so they're some of the most expensive cards in the world though but these ones aren't these are just regular regular ones that are out of pack from today but they're that's the thing about them is that the market for these is not like a baseball card or a garbage pail kit or a pack of 1980 seller pack that's the new giveaway by the way classicpackbreaks.com uh so anyways these magic cards like they'll remake the same card in different variations years later and it'll affect the value of the card the old one and the new one so I don't think I don't think they're like what you want to collect but you know I wanted to get some intel on it and I feel like I did but here's what they look like this is a good one so here let me just show you real quick so what it goes by is gonna be that little bitty the little white thing right there it's like an icon and the ones that are white and black are the commons. So you'd get, see there's a blue one. Blue, white. I know it's crazy. I, I, I just wanted a, a little knowledge on these magic cards. Matt, the new giveaway. I got it right here for you, buddy. Let me show you. You don't like my magic cards? Is that what you're telling me? They're kind of cool. But there's something different, something new. Here's your giveaway. Here's your first prize. I had to, we had to dig deep into the personal collection. Go ahead and give y'all a, a 68 tops Mickey Mantle. What a beauty. I'm not, I'm not sure why they got it at a, set, a four anyway, but first, first pot on the giveaway, 68 tops, Mickey Mantle, second place, we switched it up a little bit this time, 1980 Super Cello pack with the bubble gum still in there, mint as can be, Let's see here. Right. That's a heck of a giveaway. 
third place. We didn't go too far. Boom. 1985 Garbage Bill Kid. Mint 9. Heaven Steven. Card number 3B. Third one they made. Actually the sixth, but third. They made, do, they made 1A, 1B, and so on. Those will be the new giveaways over here at ClassicPackBreaks.com. Gonna take it easy on that solo. All right, Matt. So Matt's looking for some new baseball. Some new baseball action. Let's see here. Matt, you want to pick your spot? You want me to? Your call. You still in the chat there? Maybe, maybe not. I'll wait for you, Matt. Oh. Uh, you're the only pack I got right now. Would you want to pick it, or you want me to? You want me to pick it? All right, let's do it. Let's go bottom left, <laughs> right? Got a couple of new ones up on the board. Let me show you those real quick. 2018 Bowman Chrome. I'll have Ryan come out here and tell you all about them. These are uh, it's two jumbo box. There's an autograph in each one. I, I'm all right. Five Chrome cards per pack. Otani San and Acuna. Uh, or Acuna. Here's another new one. 2018 Bowman. Hot off the press. We went back and got another one of these too. This is the basketball edition of the fantasy sports. Same same deal. Basketball is a little bit higher, but apparently the uh, in the first vault or series one has got the Jordan and LeBron hits in it so maybe we'll get to see that one here sooner or later or me and kev will just chop it again <laughs> here's the uh here's the baker that came out of that one out of the football one i mean so now we've got the basketball one do not know what to expect out of that it's a cool card though all right matt here we go Go ahead and get your 2018 Bowman draft going. There's some guys in here that are uh, uh, Kevin. No, no, we're not. I did briefly for just a moment today. I went to this store over by where I was working, and it was like a I don't know. Like a Comic Con kind of store had had uh, had those cards. I don't know very much about it, but I, I did get some knowledge today on it actually on how to do how, you know how how you play. I mean, it's pretty serious stuff, apparently. All right, Matt. Here we go, Bo. Cole Win. Taylor Trammell.
Daniel Lynch, Adrian Morjon, Parker Meadows. They look so young. I mean, like, obviously they are, but Matt Manning, Detroit, Kid, Joe Gray, Brent Rooker, Cole Rodier, Bob Bradley. So, Kev, you know anything about that? You know anything about those magic cards? I mean, you're the Pokemon guy, right? Adam Hasley. So, you, I figured you might hit. They did have a couple of Pokemons in there. If you have any questions, put for them. Oh, wow. Well, today, man, I got my first look. Oh, there's Jonathan India Bowman Chrome car. We see him a lot, kind of. So he must be doing something. Tahana Chrome. Blake Riviera. Ready Singer. Cody Deason. Taylor Trammell Chrome. Casey Mays. Fancy cards. So, yeah, I went into the store, Kev, and the uh, guy, it was kind of like a place where you go to play them. You, where, you, where you go to play the game. And uh, they had another game in there that was, to me, like after he explained it, how, how it works, it seemed like you you really had to you really got to know your stuff i'm looking for the braves matt try him buddy thad ward casey mines sean wimmer uh so yeah yeah i mean i i i got my first little teeny taste of it today of knowing how to play. I mean, I don't, I, you know, that's a lot for me, but there's another game. Yeah. It, as far as, the, I mean, I had no idea how it, even, how it even worked and that you had to create your own deck and people go to tournaments for, you know, hundreds of hundreds of thousands of dollars and play this game. It's crazy. Ryan Rawlison. There's one for you, Matt. Ian Anderson. The next Tom Glavin right there. Kobe, what's up, buddy? What's happening? What's happening from Alaska? Nolan Gorman. That's a good card. That's probably one we're looking for right there, I guess. Nolan Gorman. Uh, I'm trying to think of the name of the other one that they were playing. Casually, and I have friends who go. Yeah, uh, let's start. Uh, uh, after like standing there talking to the guy for a half hour, I was like, my head was spinning. But there was another game that they were playing that they had set up in there. I wish I could remember the name of it, but it was like, um, it's like a game that you buy. Uh, you buy your army and you create it. Uh, it was figures on a tabletop that you use um, math and you use measurements and you create your army and you paint your army and you paint your guys and you warhammer is what it was. That's what it was. That seemed like a pretty cool game too. That that one seemed uh, that one uh, I say that, but that that was probably like because I I could understand it like a little bit better. Like uh, um, this other one here with the cards is on a whole other planet for me. Like for me to even I don't even know where to start. Like just reading the first one, you know, you got. There's some serious 
fought going into that game. This, what is it called? Magic Gathering. There's some, some real serious thought going into that. Matt, Bowman Chrome. You did get Nolan Gorman, so that's a good thing. And these other, you got quite a few other of these Bowman Chromes that are nice. So we're just hoping for some of these dudes to be good. Hawkins, Cruz, Casey Mize, Taylor Trimble, Singer, Riviera, Tejada, Jonathan India is another good one. I'm, I'm with it. But yeah, so what do you know about that one, Kevin? You played that one before? You played Warhammer before? It's uh it's some kind of Let's see here. I gotta turn my phone off. Let me get these sleeved up for Matt. What do you think, Matt? Matt, you still out there? You want to drum up a conversation for us? <laughs> the, uh, the scenes that this guy was, like, like the tabletops and stuff was, was crazy, man. I didn't even know what was going on in there. I was like, I didn't know that that was a whole nother game. I thought that was associated with this other one. But it was, it was nuts. All right. 2018 Bowman for Matt B is in the books. Where's my sticky note? That's it for now. Well, I got no more break. So now we can just talk about magic cards or whatever. So we got another one of those fantasy boxes. This one here. This is kind of cool. I'm here. I am again. Wanting, this is another box that I'm wanting to open in the house. You know, uh, for the most part, that the last one wasn't really that disappointing. You know, I mean, other than not, you know, I would rather you won the Baker. Really, <laughs> that was the only downside. But like, if you had, to, if you bought one. You know, I just don't know how to split it up. I mean, we put it on there as a single break, but it was more expensive this time. So, you know, maybe, what do y'all think? Do you think it should be, do it like that? To where two people are getting a, a pack? Or do you think that, uh, I don't know, that's a tough one for me. She's a bobblehead. That's a, that's a tough choice. In my opinion, I'm not sure what to do on that, but I, I do know that this new uh, new giveaways best one yet. Well, other than the ones when we very first started, and I was just giving away my cards, my Mickey Mantle. But having the first pick. Yeah, it was. Yeah, I'm glad you think that. Because, you know, it's kind of a one-shot deal. And you if you're going to spend the two or 300 bucks on it, you want to you get the big hit. You, I guess, you know, you don't want to. You don't want to. Well, you know, the guy the at the, guy, the, guy, the, the uh, store today said that... Uh, that he actually liked that that other card that that was a good card the uh the relic uh not relic but the other the other guy from uh pittsburgh that she the other card that was in there i mean depending on if there's two you know if that guy would have took off since 2015 or whatever then maybe you'd have some you know just like whatever just like like baker did Bang. It's still a good looking car. 
I like it. So, what do you think, Kev? I, I, Ryan Melji, you Ricky Anderson today. I, 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 I cried a tear today. If nobody buys it this week or in the next week, I'll buy it. Because I want it. And it's got some sentimental value to me. Because it was the first monster card that we pulled out. Did you already put it up on eBay? Oh, I guess you ain't got a picture of it, though. Yeah. But it's on the way. I think maybe he said he did mail it today. But I think you're right. I think the single break is the way to go. That you you you're safe to safe to get that big card because you know they're supposed to all have a, a big card. Being that, oh, all right. Uh, you're supposed to get at least one big card that's around two hundred dollars or two or three hundred dollars. Yeah, I am. I like it. I want it. I think that it's a great card. Let's figure out a deal. Or I can just pay you. I'll pay pal you or I'm, we can figure out a trade or we can get you some credit or something. Do a trade and a credit. We'll figure something out. I think that's uh, that one's got some sentimental value. We're gonna we gotta bring that one home. I think. I like that one personally. I uh that was probably the the first big one that I that I that we pulled. Like there was like real big that I thought was you know the big dog. I thought it was a ten. I thought it was a ten. I couldn't even contain myself. I thought I was out you know, he was out there playing basketball or whatever. <laughs> and he uh I guess he was watching it he was watching uh on his phone while I was out playing basketball alright so um new stuff we got up there today we got 2018 Bowman Chrome Baseball that is a uh let's see here That's the Acuna and Otani son. I'm open to making something where, yeah, yeah, man. Cool, good. I'm glad to hear that. I'm glad to hear that. I was, I should, like I said, I, <laughs> I was like, man, that was the first card to actually, like, when we mailed it out, I was like, damn, I kind of liked that one. That was like, I liked that one. So yeah, that's cool. We'll figure. I'll figure. We'll figure something out. Um. All right. So the other stuff we got to do. What else you get today? So you got two thousand uh, Bowman Chrome and two thousand Bowman. Both of them got autographs. Still got. Uh, still got nobody on the Tom Brady rookie pack uh, box. That's crazy. Or the LeBron. Those are only three bucks a spot too. I figured we'd get rid of them, so I'll open up one of those packs here pretty quick. Maybe I'll need to buy some. No, I'm saving mine. I'm saving mine because I'm going to buy a pack of 86 Fleer. Well, because I've seen all the ones that have come out of there. Or 88 Fleer. That's the box that be that needs to be got. That that box is for real. Oh, yeah. Those Dominiques and stuff that are coming out of there are pretty pretty strong. I don't know if they're tens or not, but they're it sure is fun to try and pull cards out that are that are close. Close enough to make you to guess. To think, damn. Yeah, I thought so too, man. I thought so too. I think they will. We just gotta maybe people I don't think enough people know about it, but that's what they're waiting on is just to find out about it and they're gonna be like Whoa. you got a shot at a at a LeBron James rookie card for three bucks or you could get a like a uh, jumbo bucks for th th those are two bucks so you get one or the other so Ryan's gonna have to fend for himself this weekend um, I'm out of town. I'm going duck hunting. So, you guys got to take it easy on Ryan. Yeah. 
he's he's while he's watching in there, he's trying to get Connor to sleep. Um, I like the idea, of it. but anyways, yeah, Ryan's got to fend for himself this weekend, so we hope he can do it. I'm going to Florida to go duck hunting. And it's going to be pretty cool. I'm ready. They're all there. The ducks have arrived, so it's time. We're ready. We're going to get everything loaded up. I'm going to leave Friday. I'll be back Sunday, or Monday. Monday is MLK Day, I think. I don't know if that... I need to talk to the boss about that one. I don't know. I'm off or not. I need to take off. But anyway, we're here, guys. Classic pack breaks. Yeah, Matt. Thanks for tuning in. We're here, man. You want to break another pack? I'll be here. I'm, uh, I'm going to call my girls. And uh, I'm, I guess I'll mute it for a minute until somebody wants some action and I'm here. I'm ready. Look at those three cards in there. Should come up and see the giant ice wheel here in Maine. Okay, I might check that out. Why not now? is it oh is it where they cut the they cut okay I saw, I saw that recently the other day it's where they cut a circle out and and they uh and they spin right like they spin around on it or something i saw a video the other day oh shit i don't know if this is y'all are going to be able to hear this so i don't Hey Robert, what's up, buddy? We're just hanging out. We got a uh, talking about a uh, ice wheel currently. Let's see if I can do this. Check it out. It's an ice wheel. I don't know if I'm supposed to show it. I think there's copyright stuff going on there, so I won't show it for long. But I'm with you. I see it now. I don't think this is the same one as that that I saw. So I think. What is it that I'm looking at? We go to the last look. Yeah. It's fantastic. It's awesome. Is that close to you? Is that are you close by that? That's awesome. Wow. That's cool. Is that like a new thing? Did like somebody just come up with that? Like, cause I saw that recently on, on the internet somewhere, like a, uh, I don't know what it was. It was like, it was like on a, on a, on a great lake, but everything was totally frozen solid. It wasn't like that. Like where that, there was like water, a lot of, a lot of like moving water. This was like a solid lake and they cut it. Wow. Wow. That's cool. So what are, what are they using it for? Like people go out there and just get on it and spin? Or you're not allowed to get on it? It's not, it seems kind of dangerous. I guess in that open water like that, you probably... Because the video that I saw the other day, it was like just like, like, like a foot maybe that they had cut out of the ice. Like they had cut like a foot out of the ice out of a solid lake. So like they could spin on it and play on it or whatever. And they could fall off onto the onto the, the regular ice while the other stuff was spinning. So this is a little bit different. This is like somebody did this, you know, to, I guess, draw some attention. Pretty cool though. I don't suppose you're allowed to get out there on it, right? Probably not. Seems a, seems a little dangerous for the kids.
Hotel Dishwasher awarded $21 million after boss made her work on Sundays. Mm-hmm. Widow of murdered California camper files $90 million lawsuit. Man, all, there's all kinds of stuff going on here. Yeah, yeah, not out on this one. Okay, I got you. If you look, um, you'll know, you'll see the one I'm talking about. If you look it up, you look it up on YouTube or something. It's got, it's like the exact same thing, except they, they, they cut it out of it like a solid ice, like in a lake that was frozen solid. And it spun within the ice, kind of, you know what I mean? To where it wasn't dangerous. But I had seen that before, which is pretty cool. This is crazy. The, all the, the, the ads on this page are just nuts. Alright, I gotta quit looking at this. Alright, um, okay, we're here. I'm here, Ryan's here. We got no more breaks currently at the moment, but we will be here if you want to break the pack. Classicpackbreaks.com. Hop on the site, check it out, see what you think. There's something for everybody on there. We got football, baseball, basketball, hockey, soccer, racing, garbage bill kids, wrestling, Star Trek, Star Wars, uh, Charlie's Angels. We got it all. I don't know if I ever put Charlie's Angels up on the board though, but maybe. I might have. Alright, I'm going to mute you for a minute. And, uh, run to the restroom. I'm, we're here, man. If y'all want to break something, let me know. Classicpackbreaks.com.
going on guys we got Connor to sleep no problem Jackson's hanging out with grandma tonight I'm not sure if you guys with that um there's some stuff in that Bowman Chrome there those guys are uh, every single one of them is in the green on the plus how's everybody doing tonight let's see check these guys out from 2018 Bowman Chrome prospect autographs there and we're only seeing base and there's one refractor showing so if you start pulling some short print numbered autographs of these guys you're going to be talking some really nice cards that's the Bowman Chrome you can still pull that but some chrome out of regular 18 as well we've got big Otani's in here Otani, Otani autographs and short print There's a giveaway, guys. Pretty cool one here. 68 Mantle. A Super Cello. 80 Baseball. And a Mint 9 GPK. Get John, get John together over here. Well, um, Robert, we opened a football one of these um, the other day, and this was the big hit out of the football box. There's four items in there. Um, there's two encased cards and then there's two random packs of cards this was the big hit out of the foot one of the football boxes we opened um, and then there was a Mason Rudolph immaculate to 49 and then we had a couple random packs and one of the packs actually had an autograph in it as well the word on the street is that fantasy sports break basketball series one has LeBron's and Jordan big cards in it possible dude that tell about the dude that got one yeah, evidently there's been a uh, a Jordan five and a half Beckett pulled out of one of these basketball boxes. Eighty six Fleer. Eighty six Fleer, yeah, Jordan rookie Beckett five and a half. And that's just we don't even know what was in the rest of it. Other than. 
the last, I think one of the last ones they opened had <clears throat> two one of ones. One of them was a Russell Westbrook card that was a one of one. And gosh, who else did they say? I mean, it was a good name, you know, but it wasn't, uh, you know, like a super, super stud. But I guess the Russell Westbrook was the big one in there. But it was two one and ones in, in it. But it's not necessarily all new stuff. Right? No, I think there's a mix, you know. I think there could be basically almost anything in there. That's the, that's the, what was in the, uh, in the packs? The, the packs weren't bad packs either. They were, they had, uh, I can't remember what exactly the packs were. I know one of them had an autograph in it. Yeah. Um, I don't know. But, uh, Ryan said that. That uh, the baker was going for two fifty on eBay, or whatever. Yeah, somebody hopped in the chat when we pulled it and said it was two hundred and fifty dollar card on eBay sale. It is an interesting gamble, Matt. That's one. Really, uh, you know, the first time we got it. had it for a couple of days and we didn't know what to do how to split it up so Kevin and I split it and uh, we just randomized it and I I got two spots he got two spots that's basically how we made it had it made it work but we were just talking about earlier tonight that it's it's a better it's a better one shot, and whoever gets it get get the big hit and the other ones, you know, because then you got a chance of real. Because I think there's a in the cases there's one real big one, like I think that that the, they put like one real big card. Well, they told me today actually, you know, because I I had thought that it was basically you know they kind of put eight hundred dollars into a case, and evidently, you know. There's some cases where you could possibly actually, you know, make over your, what you paid for the case even. But then obviously some are, you know, they only put back seven or eight hundred in product. There's something about putting scripture on the box that makes me feel like that they are not out to cheat you. It's, it seems like an honest company that would... If, if you're gonna if you're gonna put God's word on the box you better back it up and it feels like it feels like a safe play if you just get the whole box not necessarily how me and Kevin did it uh, four four or I mean you know, four ways but it could work you know that's I mean that just saves you a little bit of money you know you're willing to you, you got to be willing to take a gamble at that point. And it kind of saves you a little bit of money and you could potentially, I mean, the way we should do it is if we ran it two people, then, you know, the winner should get the first pick, obviously. And then the net, the other person should get everything else. <clears throat> yeah. Maybe something like that, you know. To where, you know, the winner put half of the money in and got the big hit, but then the guy that got, you know, the second well, what if place. There's like two gigantic cards in there. Well, that's where that's where the, that's that's the fine line is that if there's two, if there's two big ones in a box, then we make up our own way of breaking it up, and then somebody gets. That's why it just needs to be a one box you know and not split up in my opinion but if you guys think something else you just let us know we'll split it up yeah if you want but I, you know 
I think it's better. It's another it's, one of those ones that I sure not knowing is crazy. Like every box in here, I know what the cards. I know what they look like, and I know what the possibilities of what cards could be in them. And that's an awesome thing. But that box there, I have no idea. That's what's weird about it. That's what. That's what I don't know. And you know what else made us feel good about it is that Easy Ed chimed in you remember another guy that's from atlanta the atlanta area and he's seen this stuff and he's and he said that it's good stuff yeah and exactly. then we and that was like someone that you know just randomly randomly had heard of it i guess or maybe maybe he's he had you know he might already got one maybe i know he's got good <clears throat> montana Probably on the way. Yeah, it's on the way. Uh, yeah, me too. Me too. Well, as well as the, the you know, the, I, I feel good about it. The guy, the the local card shop guy where we're at is, um, you know, he's been around for quite a long time. He knows a lot of people. He was just out in california at the upper deck some upper deck convention and you know he had some photo ops with wayne gretzky and stuff so i i feel pretty comfortable you know about about him and he, you know he, he's he puts his reputation behind it i i feel pretty good about it he's not out he's not a crook by any means He's a, he's a good guy. John. Alright, so that's John. Matt says let's break one of those tiger packs. Which one, Matt? Classicpackbreaks.com. Hop on there. Which one do we got in here? Hop on there, Matt. What do you need? You need 15% off? Man. Here's Tiger. Need 15% off? How about this? There's a bunch left in here too, buddy. Look for signed, authenticated stars. Sign of the Times autographs in box. Here we go. 44 regular gold refractors. What are you reading off of? They 18 fairway grades. What? Might not be able to hear you. Uh, well, face another way and stuff. It's just some of that knowledge from Matt. Sixty tour swatch green parallels. Sixty tour swatch red. Authenticated star gold cards. Number to one hundred. SP. Yeah. Could be Tiger Autos in there, man. Gold number to 500. This is too good of a giveaway here. I don't think we can give one of these away. I like them. I'm going to have to just buy myself a pack of 86, 88 clear. We'll have an Andy break night. Maybe I can get a wheel spin. Robert, I, I should I should probably be able to tell you, but there's there's the website. Um, and like I said, you know our um, Look our, it up. our local guy deals with them all the time, so we'll check it out. We'll check it out right now. See what it says. I I haven't been to the website. What it is. No, I have not either. Here's your information right here. Pull it up on the uh, little 
Genial. Sí. Here we go. That's the first, the first K. Yeah, there's a football one right there. I don't know if you're allowed to watch videos though, or have mute or have sound. Right? Is it sound or is it video? Oh, Kevin. What I was going to tell you is that I didn't realize that that ice wheel. I, after I went in there and I was thinking about it, that ice wheel. That's like that was made. Uh, that was a natural. That thing made itself. I didn't realize that. I, and when we were talking about it, that's even cooler than the ones that I saw those people making. That's that's neat. Back to that. I meant to say that earlier. They actually show a mantle on their on their website. Are those all the autos? Who all is that? That's Bryce Harper. I see Trout up there. Trout with a piece of a bat. Oh, yeah. What's that? What's that? Hank Aaron autographed one. Right here. Yeah. Is that a vintage one or is that a? Yeah, I mean, it, they, there's good stuff, man. I can, I'm telling you, Art, the lo, you know, Joe's went through cases and cases and cases of this stuff. Robert, we uh, we can, we could. Uh, we just had to talk to Joe about it. He told us that he, he just told us that uh, he could probably get he can get whatever we need. We haven't really messed with any leaf. I haven't even seen any leaf. I mean, We've done some leaf. We've done a couple boxes of leaf ultimate draft. Uh, the football. Football, yeah. But not leaf baseball. Does leaf make baseball? Um, yeah, probably. They. I'm sure they have some sort of products. Oops. It's a pretty cool... Uh, Leaf made Leaf made cool stuff back in the they day. They have uh, they have I've seen some of those. Uh, he's he's got one up in the shop. You know they did some of those old school leaves and stuff. Yeah, some of those throwback looking cards. Yeah, that, Is that was, what those were. That was in that Leaf Ultimate Draft. <clears throat> the, the throwback one. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know, like the '90 style or something, the '91 style. You talking about the? You're talking about a new card. The ones that the ones that I was talking about to get were the old leaves, like '85 leaf, yeah, with the little leaf on the card. You know. Yeah, Robert's talking about newer leaf stuff. Do we have any of that? I don't think so. We don't have any more of those leaf uh, ultimate drafts either. Uh. -uh. Talk to him about that. I mean, might as well. We're gonna we try to check the logistics of what what we can pull up on there and what we can't. As far yeah, as well, I know Rogan can't do it. What do you mean? Like he can't show videos on his videos. It's like a copyright thing. We give all credit where credits is due. Yeah, I don't think that you're allowed to do that. To, you can, you got. I think you can look at other people. You can look at websites. Maybe you can. It's maybe it's music or or it's sound. Uh, I, I'm, you know, I don't know. I know, well, they'll definitely hit you for, for music. Is that what it is? The music part of it? Yeah. Okay. So, what did it say on that other website? There's the 81 Cello, guys. Or the 80 Super Cello, rather. We're giving away. Which is it? Hundred bucks on there. Hundred dollar value. That's a deal on the website. Much less. 
Beautiful one. Too many crickets. You got the 13 Bowman Jumbos, four autos in the box. Still have an auto in the 14 draft, still have an auto in the 18 Prism. We got Brady packs. That Crown Royal, uh, that hadn't opened that yet, that's got a lot of in it too, doesn't it? Yeah, I think it's got some stuff in it. I feel like uh, Drew Brees was on the one of the packs that we opened out of that fantasy box. It was like a 2015 or something, wasn't it? Yeah, I think it was. The fan, the, the, the for the fantasy box. We got 1972 basketball. 1972 football second series man that was amazing good time out uh, maybe Yeah, when you pull it up, it and it's and it wants you to log in again. That's I think when it's cut off, possibly. Yeah, guys, use the coupon code Mint fifteen at checkout. Fifteen percent off tonight. Wow, he's lost it. Rock and roll, have at it. He's lost it. He's lost it. We'll be up all night. Have at it. You're lucky I didn't do 20. 20? You're lucky I didn't That's do 20. That's not a real... We don't even have one. Is that a real thing? No, not until it's created and it takes typing and like saving and sending. Uh, I don't even know if we have that. We got the Neek off to... Uh, Headed toward PSA today. Yeah, so anyway, cool. again, so yeah, I mean, there's what came out of first fantasy box break we did. That's pretty cool. Not, I'm curious to see what. I'd love to see an old car, an old Jordan or something. 86, uh, 86 Fleur Jordan, dude. Golly. Baker to 70. He's kind of cool. We need him. He needs to just take off, take the Cleveland to the next level and let all of his shit go up through the roof. He doesn't, he's not scared. No. No, he ain't. You can see the border. Those are fresh out of a box. Box fresh. Look at the gum. It's awesome. And a nice Mason Rudolph when he had a future. Yeah, the, the guys at the shop today, they like Mason Rudolph. They've been grooming him. They've been grooming him for Big Ben's exit. That's what I think.
filling the new intro. Just got to figure and get the logistics of it. You didn't, I missed the chat. That was what I. Did. <clears throat> you didn't. You didn't have it. I didn't uh, log in the stupid chat, so it took me five minutes when I first started to do anything. It was like spinning my wheels at first, but I feel like I got the. I started it, and I, th I feel like it started. I want to watch it back. Yeah. You couldn't do it? He's no Aaron Murray. Who? He's Rudolph? still playing football, isn't he? Aaron Murray's not playing football, is he? I don't, not to my knowledge. Aaron, Aaron Murray's making Dodge commercial for Aikens, Dodge, and Chrysler, Athens. I, I didn't think he was even playing anymore. He could kill it if it happened uh, as a broadcaster or any of that. Let's open that 54 one card. Let's open one of these. Can you imagine? You want to talk about men. <laughs> Let's open one of those. <laughs> I saw, um, is that in here? Let me see that thing. Nickel. Let me see the, uh, <clears throat> let me see that PSA back. Is it in here? I'm not sure. I saw somebody open it a different way. Oh, okay. I guess that was sarcasm out of my... Spurry ain't really playing nothing. Um, Teddy, no. Not yet, buddy. It's still uh, up for sale. We uh, we just got the, this is the basketball one. The uh, ba This is the basketball box. We're giving her a go now. Yeah, it's actually the... It's supposed to be a little, a little bit... The hot, more, it's a little bit touch higher because of the LeBron and Jordan possibilities, is what I'm told. It's heavy. I guess he's not in the chat, but I hope that answers your question. Who's that, Ted? Mm hmm. Maybe we gotta do a giveaway for some so we can open up some cards. Probably could. If you want. I know Matt's in. Kev's in. Just rip one and then if you pull it, rip, you know, one of these or something. But if you pull something, raffle it off. Is that the one you want to open? I don't know. Let's open a, a 304 NBA basketball. <laughs> I'd like to just cut it out of the thing and see what a pack looks like. It's jumbo. Is it? How many are in there? 35. 35 a pack? LeBron's on that. I'm about to hop on Classic Pack Brady back home. <clears throat> Pull something down. I think it's going to be the 86 oh, flare. Yeah. Can you 88 flare. Can you almost tell that card or no? Is that the back or the front? What's the back? Or the, you mean the back of the card or the front of the card? Yeah. Hold the zoom in on it. That's the front. That's not a back. That's a glove. Isn't it? Yeah, it's hard to tell. Pull it up on the TV. Bird bombers. <coughs> Zoom in right there. That's what we're talking about right there. 67. Nasty. I 
that's cool. Yeah. I think I like the box better myself. What's that? That box is kind of cool. Yeah. It, uh... It's got a little Daryl Dawkins going. That's cool. Alright, well... You want to give something away? Or you want to go... Eat? Leave it running? Um... Yeah, we're here, guys. Classic pack breaks. Mint 15 is going to get it done at 15. checkout. He lost his mind. 15. Classic pack breaks. We're here. We're up. We're ready to go. On demand. We appreciate you guys hanging out. We'll see you in just a bit.
All right, all right, we're back. Robert's in. All right, let's do this. We got good ones now. Good picks, man. Let's make sure our chat's still up and all that good stuff. But we'll get it all figured out here. Classic pack breaks. We got some got some action for you. We got a couple of wheel spins. We got uh, maybe I'll ask to see what Ryan wants to do. Start a new recording. Maybe that's what we ought to do. Yeah, we might be all right. We'll be all right. Yeah. Okay. Right on. All right, Robert. Great choices, man. We got another 88 Fleer to rip, man. We got a 54 Bowman Penny Pack, man. That's fantastic. That's awesome. That is a cool old pack there, man. That's that's cool. Alright, so alright. Let's get started. Let's get you a couple wheel spins going here. Let's get you going on a wheel before we even get into the real meat and potatoes. Alright, we appreciate you, Robert. Here we go. What are we looking for on this? You got a little 88, 89 Fleer. Um, let's get that 81, huh? We hadn't got it in a minute. That'd be a great one to go with these. Alright, Robert. Good luck, buddy. Be there. Like the roulette table. One more time around. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Boom! <laughs> you go to the casino. All right, there's the first one. There's still some good cards in that 81. Maybe, what about another Joe? All right, maybe some. Let's see if we can get two of them, huh? 89, oh, okay. You got some of those. Why not one more? All right, 89 Fleer basketball. We got, and we got, uh, let's see here. All right, we got we got 88 Fleer coming. We got 89 Fleer coming. Oh, sorry, guys. Looking at the ceiling. There we go. All right. I'm telling you, it takes two people in here to do this. Not easy. All right, here we go. What else we got? We got 81 tops football. We got Ryan's gonna have to go get the penny pack. I think the penny pack is in there. That's in the. Alright, um. What else? Let's go ahead and get going on some 89 flare. Oh, here. No. Yeah, the penny pack's in the safe. Let's get Ryan to get on that. Alright, Robert, so what do you think, buddy? What, do you, what, what order do you want to go in tonight? Let's see here. Oh, 81 baseball, too. Forgot about that. Oh, here, Ryan. Here we go. All right, so we got a little baseball, we got a little basketball, we got a little football. You have a preference? I say we do the wait. We'll wait and do the 88 Fleer and the and the 54 Bowman because those are the meat and potatoes. Maybe the Joe Montana. We'll put that ahead of the list. Let's start with the Fleer. Let's do it. All right, 89 Fleer. You got a preference, Robert? Or maybe we need to check the. Uh, Maybe we need to check the bottom of that for a couple. One, two, three, four. There's four. Five. All right. All right, so I kind of organized it to do uh, 
So he's getting five of these, two, four, five of these first, and then maybe do an 81 cell and then kind of go backwards. That's what I'm thinking. Okay, nope, he said. I guess that means he didn't have a preference. Let's do it. What's the bonus with it? 81 football. Finally. Did it? Yep. And what else? Uh, another pack of 88, uh, 89 Fleer, so you got five now total. Alright, here we go, Robert. We're looking for MJ, and we're looking for the MJ sticker. Appreciate it, Robert. Yeah, man, we appreciate you. Johnny Newman. We were here, we are shooting the breeze for a little while. From Kersey. Robert Reed. He's probably on that basketball back there. We got some of them. All of them. There he is. The name. Bricklayer. Yeah, Robert. You do. You get spins and you get spots. You get two. Two spots. You get it you get it all, my man. We just, we appreciate you. We do. That's uh that mantle's probably the best card we put up on the giveaway board yet. And uh and uh eighty cello is the one of the best ones we've given away yet as well. So actually all three of them are three of the best uh giveaway prizes yet. So pretty excited about that. Paul Presley. Chris Mullins with the flat top. Let's get the flat top going tonight. Thurl Bailey. Hakeem the Dream. Lajuan. Scott Brooks. Big fella. Let me hear. Jeff Hornacek. Three packs of 81 football. We're down to three. Here we go, guys. This is our our same same style of unveiling. We're looking for card number three. Uh. There you go. Uh. Is it possible to get an 89 standard? It, is it possible? Ah, it's possible to pull an MJ out of the first pack, though. Um, this is kind of centering right here, Robert. On these, on the, the this is a tough centering pack right here. This, these stickers, man, compared to the 80, 88. I think we just got a really good box of 88. Yeah, well, either way, when you get an 89 all star. That's nice. That'll work for the first one. Good card. Good card. Those, all, those suckers get all centered though, man. I'm telling you. Alright, let's see his base card now. Alright, here we go. Daryl Walker. These, the, 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 the regular cards are centered up nicely though. I don't have that Jordan in my personal collection. Good. Good. Now you do. <laughs> Vernon Maxwell. Vernon Fleming. You got an 86 Fleer, Robert? That's the one. I traded it for a uh, garbage pill kid when I was about eight years old, and the guys who I traded it to, his mom called my mom, and I had to trade it back because it was already a good card then, and that was in 1986 or seven or something, maybe 88 or 89, I guess, Gary Grant. 
I wonder if he still has it, but it was banged up. It wasn't mint. You have three. Nice. Oh, nice. Are they all graded? Well, you got um, slabs on them. That's the that's the one. Chris Welp. I'm just not sure. Richard Anderson. Mark West. Danny Ainge. Which one? Alright, sticker time. Good luck. Here we go. Ooh, who's number one? The mailman. Golly, look at the centering on these. Crazy. Still a good sticker. I think that's the way they expected those 88s, too. They were surprised at the centering of the 88 when they saw it today. What? The 88 clear knee that I took them to grade. Oh, uh, what, what did he say about that today? I mean, you know, there's a couple little things, but I, I think it's got a shot at a nine. Yeah, I do too. Are you leaving? You had enough? Pulled MJ out of first bag. Alright, Robert. Where's that base card, MJ? No, not in the best shape. Yeah, that was the problem with that card. I think the one that I traded for a garbage bill kit is probably in bad shape too. By the time I got it home, Tom Battle. Hmm. Herb Williams. Here we go. Bird man. I gotta sleeve him up. Larry Legend? Yeah, Larry Legend. Indiana. Where was he from? Terre Haute or something? Mm -hmm. French Lake? Oh, uh, yeah, maybe. Dan Shade. Car Wright. Terry Teagle. Brad Daughtry. 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 That'll work. He's an announcer for the NASCAR now. Daugherty. Daugherty. Yeah, that's right. Daughtry's a guy on uh, American Idol. American Yeah, he like well he, he finished second or third. Robert Kerr rookie card. Which one? Brad Darty? <laughs> I still can't say it. Cleveland. He's 86. It says 86 on the back there. I don't know if that's his. If some of them are. There's Neeks, brother. AC Green. That one's the one who's got that kooky eye. <laughs> Did you see that thing with that, the, uh, in man, Benjamin. the Adam Gaze or whatever, the old Miami coach? I guess he got a new job somewhere. I can't remember where it was. Uh huh. <clears throat> But he did, he was sitting down to do some interview, man, and his eyes were, like, his eyes were, like, just, like, fluttering around. Look at the centering on these stickers. It, he looks so strange. He really did. Larry Christowiak and Chris Mullen. These are tough, man. <clears throat> Is 
So you get a bird though, and a uh, Chris Mullen sticker. All right, here we go. Where's that MJ? Maybe we gotta go backwards this time. I don't really like laying it down on the on the card like that. Maybe just on the mouse pads better. This is the only one that's face down in the pack. Bernard King. Rick Berry. Mike Gaminski. Gaminski. There's your boy Dantley, or uh, Kaz, buddy. I think he pulled his a couple of times. Kevin Johnson. Our centering's gonna pick up on the on the '88 Fleer, I think. <laughs> yeah, I think so too. Wow, that's a good looking Rodman. We'll sleeve up Rodman, the Worm, second year car. We hadn't got his rookie yet either. Out of, he's an 88, right? That's right. Or is he 86? No, he's 88. Winston Garland. We're, we haven't got, the only guy we've gotten is Reggie out of 88. Really, I mean, we've gotten the Bird All-Star. <clears throat> I'm not even, have we gotten the regular? We got a couple of Neeks. Have we gotten the regular Bird? No. Bud. Wilkins and Malone. Mailman. There's a Reggie coming up next. Ed Pickney. And then Scotty right behind him. Oh, you saw it before I did. How the hell did you see it before I did? I saw <clears throat> that was the same run from the other day, remember? Because we were saying if it was an 88 pack, we'd be. Who was the sticker? Do you remember? No, I don't know. I'm not that good. <laughs> Chuckster, maybe? Ewing? Like I said, these are tough. <clears throat> these ones should be ex high too. They are. I mean, the difference between a 9 and a 10 on these are big. Well, you're a long way from center. That's crazy. Alright, last one. Where is it? We need the base card, MJ. Robert. I didn't sleeve up Scotty, but you can do that. Alright, here we go. Kurt Rambis. Mike Sanders. Tom Chambers. John Battle. So Barry Carroll, another bird man. Let's see that one up in there. Herb Williams, <clears throat> Bill Cartwright. We've seen this one, haven't we? Look, there he is, Dan Shays. There's your boy, American Idol. Rookie card. That one looks better. Sleeve that one up. NASCAR. The mouth of the NASCAR these days. Alright, here we go. Terry Teagle. Terry Cabbage. Mike Woodson was the Falcons coach. 
or I mean honks. AC googly eyed green. How about you? He was like, man, I can't wish they'd have got me a better picture. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, we got Neeks, brother. Come on, eight. Dale Ellis. Hadn't seen that one yet. I feel like, let me check on that one real quick. Is it still just? It's just on like, on, on another street, on like the next street over. <laughs> There's Dale Ellis. Wow, it isn't. The big one, ten. This is. Yeah. I mean, even the uh, eights that you can get with the off centering are still a couple, couple bucks. Uh, these are just hanger on to or is here. That's all. All right. That's uh. All right. So here's our eighty ones. Is that right? Yeah, you got two of those. Two. Mm-hmm. Right on. Okay. Now we're getting to a little bit more action here. More flavor. Yeah, a little more flavor. More spice. Dave Smith. We'll do the Dave Smith one first. <clears throat> All right, here we go, Robert. Eighty-one top space for guys. Classic pack break com. Tightly wrapped in there. Those were protected. Adjacent. What is it? What's she saying? All right, let's get some some going here. Man. Craig Swan. It's a nice looking card there. Dave Parker. You got him on there? 640. $10.9 and a $200.10. Oh, that's what we're talking about. There we go. Oh, that's what we're talking about. Dave Parker. Look pretty good. Yeah. Dave Ford. Yeah, man, no problem. Absolutely. Seven oh six. Jim Spencer. Four thirty five. Wow, centering. It's there, Jerry Mumphrey. Five five six. Here's our here's our two gummers. California Angels card. Ellis Valentine. That's the guy that's got the half of a football helmet cut in, cut in half. Like a putter. Mm-hmm. 445. <clears throat> Angels team car. Any of those on that list? That weird list? 663. No. <clears throat> Moose Hoss. Oh. Good name. <clears throat> Milt Wilcox. That prospect's name now is that is Carter Kaboom. Carter Keyboom. Dan Quisenberry Raleigh Fingers. Tom Hume. Card number eight. Leading Fireman. Kind of a cool card, huh? Not on there? They don't agree with it. Got that Joe Carbonara the other day. Why don't you bring all Expos team card? And there's your Dave Smith. Gotta have Dave. He 
was not Dave. It was going to be Terry Pull. Yeah, really? Okay, that's pack one for him. All right, we got Dave Parker. That's nicely centered. And Raleigh Fingers. Leading Fireman, but that one's not on the list for some reason, but sorry. Do it again. I even feel like these had more of a chance for some reason to see some of those no namers. No namer, no tens. And the cello packs as well. Yeah, Parker looks good. It's a good looking card. It ought. Here we go, man. 81 football coming up. There's our boy Vukovic. We've seen him before. Look at the centering on him. Vuk. Butch Hobson. Greg Luzinski. Jim Dwyer. Mm-hmm. 184. No. Doyle Alexander coming up next. Who's a Yankee, wasn't he? <clears throat> Bill Campbell on this side. Doyle plays for your Tigers, too. He played for the Braves, too. Bill Campbell. Little OC. Look at the dust flying off this thing. Crazy. Clean it up a little bit. It's 708. No Doyle? Not yet. Not yet. Maybe one. Alright, here we go, guys. Here we go, guys. Mike Phillips. 113. It's a good looking card. I like this one. 113? Yeah. There's your Bobby Bond. Ooh, he's on there. He's, he's off center a little bit. Want six thirty five on bonds. Twelve dollar nine. Uh, this one's way off center, unfortunately. Nino Espinosa. Five. You anything? Oh. Willie Randolph. That one's been pinched by that cell a little bit. Card sixty. And a White Sox manager card. That one got pinched a little bit too. Did you see uh, Willie Randolph on there? No. Uh -uh. No Willie either. Willie Montanez. Oh, yeah, that's who it was. All right, I'm going to skin up. It's starting to get hot in here. We're going to get to the good stuff. All right. You got a little taste of a good card in the, each of them. All right. What do you reckon we do next? I guess maybe the... Uh, the way those stickers are looking, I'd go... 81 football then finish up with this 88 clear you think is it just one of these but it's not much choice. is it just one of these yes but when you said it was wheel spin yeah i, I waited i waited for it because this was a good wheel spin oh he's robert says 54. oh he's ready for it now you can do that Let's do this. One card penny pack. Look at this thing. Oh my gosh. We're talking about vintage. 
You can feel the gum sliding around there. That the pack you're looking for there, Bo? <laughs> the pack, just the package is, is cool. That's awesome. All right. You got it pulled up. We got one card in here <clears throat> from 1954. Remember George Blanda, Otto Graham, Doak Walker, Y. Tittle. Bobby Lane, Frank Gifford, Look at it. Leo Nimanelli, Nimalini, Leo Namalini. <laughs> this is insanity. All right, here we go. One shot. Man, good luck, Robert. Oh man. Bill Bowman. Bowman himself? Couldn't have been the same guy. Look, there's a piece of gum still. Oh my gosh. It's mint though. Wow. Card number 17. There it is. Bill Bowman, 17. Wow. That's old. Kind of got a little bit of a... Look at the gum is done to the pack. Holy shit. That was, that was cool. That was crazy. Let's get this sleeve up. Yeah, it is, man. Zeke Bratkowski. It's taller card, too. 54 Bowman. Interestingly enough, you... Commons only get you a hundred and a quarter and a nine. Is what PSA says. That's a cool card, man. Yeah, that's a... Those that's corners look nice. Nice looking card. It's a little bit off-centered, but... For the most part... It looks nice. Bill Bowman fullback. Look at that. It's a little taller than a regular card, it feels like. That's cool. Got a tiny little crease, little spot right there from the gum. Just barely, but it's not even hardly showing through. Wow. Look at the corners. Yeah. Nice corners, card. The corners are nice. That's... Dig it. I dig it. Alright. Pulverized? Yeah. Oh, whoops. Here's this. We'll save that. We'll pour that gum out so we can show them the pack. We'll send this with it. Look at that. <laughs> Jeez. That is not seen the light of day in a long time. So a little bit of water. That is like... No, I mean that like maybe like the humidity or something. It's not like water. It's more like a... Like air Did affecting the gum. Did he, uh, Did he what? Did he hit anything out of the Bowman baseball? Uh, you got a Nolan Gorman, a guy. A new guy we were been talking about. An autograph? No. No <laughs> autograph. I'll let you know. Alright, Robert, I'll send you this too. Not bad. I mean, it's a 54 Bowman. That's pretty cool. It's crazy that there's just a one card pack, but it's neat. It's neat. Yeah. <laughs> the the pack's almost as cool as the guard. 
I mean, you just don't even see that any, anywhere anymore. You got cool. The 81 football. Uh, yeah. All right. Here, this is a. Here, throw, throw them that too. We appreciate you hopping on that one. Right. Yeah, that's a good one. That's cool. We're gonna, what we're is gonna this, give a you a little. Yeah, we're gonna give you a little extra one on that. Oh, uh, right on. Uh, one card, and we'll give you a pack with 30, 40 cards on. We appreciate you taking the taking the leap on that. That was cool. That's a that's a one shot. One shot wonder. I mean, it's still a. It looks seventy-five dollars and eight or nine, sharp, right? Sharp card. No, any bad. All right, here we go. Pivot a little bit, a couple of years. Eric Sipton. Uh, I, I don't even know Albert song. Tyler Frank. I feel like I'll know him when I see him. Oh, sorry guys, I was holding it a little low. Oh, well, actually, it tells you on the back Chris of the card the, um, where they were drafted. Tim Kate. George Guzman. Colton Eastman. Silver Noose. Levi Kelly. Ezekiel Pagan. I think there's still an auto or two in the Bowman draft. Yeah, oh, is there? I think so. Grant Little. Bowman Chrome, Bowman Chrome, Nick Decker. Look, see a couple of shiners back there. <laughs> I'm shiner that eye. There's a. One of those little throws. Casey Mines, yeah. Here we go. When was that Pompeii drafted? Look at the back of that one. Tristan Pompeii. I'll tell you, like up top, right under his name. Um, third round. Okay. 89th overall. Good looking card, though. Check the chat. Chaz Chisholm. That one's got a fracture, too. Diamondback signed him as a free agent. Grace, Grayson Rodriguez. Should be good still. Mackenzie Gore. Nick Decker. He was already in this pack. There's your Pompey base. Logan. Still no auto. No, not yet. Hmm. Cal Mitchell. Jeter Downs. Wow. We got two packs of the 18 draft left now, guys, and I'm virtually certain one of them's got an autograph in it. Well, there's just some inside information. There's a free pack for Robert. Thank you, Robert. All right, let's see here. All right, we're on. Uh, where are we at now? We're up to. Uh, you got the 81 football and 88 Fleer st still left, I think. Okay. I was all ready to go on this a minute ago. I had picked a dandy. For Robert. All right, bud. Here we go. Getting to the good stuff. Oh, well, and... <laughs> Not that we just didn't open a 1954 pack, which was very cool. Or Bowman, Bowman pack, got Bowman himself. All right, 81 football. We know who we're looking for in here. Bob Thomas. Billy Taylor. Guys, if, re, if you're going in for that Bowman draft, we only got two left. Donnie Shell. So if you're after that, refresh re, refresh your side. I just updated the product. Ricky Thompson. 
Pat Donovan. Vince Adams. Evans, excuse me. Greg Hawthorne. Yeah. Cards really look nice though. Casey. The Casey Mize is the uh he's the first overall pick. Oh wow well shit, I got him in the other pack too. A couple of, I saw his name so many times that I Casey Mize is the first overall. He was in the first one that Matt got. Yeah. I'm, I saw his name so many times that I remember his name. I he's might on, got his, he's on the box, isn't he? I might have got his refractor too. Three fifty five. Tony Hill. Chuck Foreman. Here we go. A couple of studs on there. Ooh, great centering too. That's a good card. Raiders leader with Lester Hayes and Ted Hendricks on it. It's nice. Card number 359. Morristown. Looks nice centering too again. Lester Hayes. HOF. Lester Hayes? Yep. Oh, is it? Hang on, that might be uh He's on the other one too. Card number five. Card number 359. Mm, it might be the single card though. Yeah, I think it is. John Jefferson. Starting as gray. Super action. No, Nicely centered. Doesn't look like it's 81. Dan Hampton. Maybe it's 80. He's on there, isn't he? 316. Yeah, that's a rookie, I think. Ooh, that's a good one. Rookie Hall of Fame. $40.9750 plus 10. Whoa. Look at this one. Alright. Look at the centering on this one. There you go, Robert. Nice. That one's a good looking card there. It's got a tiny little print action going right there the only thing i see a little smudge or something yeah man that's a nice good one yeah, i'm sure it is i knew i recognized that name for a reason nice that one's all green too isn't it? rookie hall of fame that's a big one plus forty dollar nine nice all right robert here we go my friend here we go. 1988 Fleer basketball. It's got to be in here, man. Right? We haven't seen a Jordan yet. Not one Jordan. Not of any kind, any type, any sort, any anything. So, not a sticker, not a... None of it. Not with a mouse, not on the house, not in the rug. That's right. <clears throat> Did I see you struggling a little bit with the uh, backwards unveiling? Right? No, I don't think so. No. <laughs> okay, good. Good luck, my friend. I picked you a good one. Yeah, that is certainly gradable. That Dan Hampton is nice. Yeah. Good grief. Blair Rasmussen. Let's go ahead and work through that later. i get you a good one here, Robert. Paul Pressey. Danny Ainge.
Byron Scott. Let's get tropical, Matt says. That's a Flint Tropics. Who's <laughs> on the track? Oh, right on. Good. That, that was one that Robert needed right there. Right on. Good. Yeah. All right. Bears fan, too. Okay. Nice, nice, nice. Michael Cage. I just like that name for some reason. Sounds like a movie star. Dave Corzine. It looks super centered. I didn't see that little smudge until Andy pointed it out, but it looks great. Yeah, it's, it's, the card's perfect except for the little bitty smudge. Little, little bitty smudge. Jack Sigma. We got time. We got plenty of clays to. Have. We got all his cards. And Doc. That one's centered up nicely, too. Oh, man. I saw a pacer. Mike Woodson. Well, we're already there, guys. It's time. The time is upon us. All right, man. Here, Here we, we go. Flaming Tisdale's covering up our sticker. This one doesn't have a number, so. Ooh, we. Birdman. Dog. God, look at the centering. Huh? Is that is it right top to bottom? Yeah, I think maybe that's uh, left to right. It's dead nuts. It's even closer than any of them I've seen yet. I think. I'm feeling like. Let's get a good close look at it. See that bottom line? Just a tad. Not quite as thick as the other two, but I don't know if that's what they're graded basing it on. Yeah. Okay, I see it. Yeah, top one. That's a nice card there, Robert. Oh, uh, that's a hundred dollar nine. And seventeen fifty if they're having a good day at PSA and want to throw a ten on it. What's the back look like? So. Yeah, it is. What a great card, man. Uh, we haven't seen that one yet. Golly, I like this box. That's a nine. That's it. Is a nine. I'm saying that's a nine. I'm th that's that's a nine. Damn. CPB's quick grading system. Yeah. We'll turn it around for you guys in no time. He says maybe eight or nine. Yeah, I'm. I agree. Oh, it's, yeah, certainly an eight. It's, yeah. There's no, no way it's... Less than eight. Yeah. No, it's not. Not with that centering. Maybe just a touch. I can hardly tell. Even with the naked eye on the side of the left or right. All right, I got I got gum dust on me. All right, Robert. Well, not bad. You did all right, didn't you? That that fifty four was nice. That was cool. That was yeah, a cool that card. card was cool. Yeah. Let's see that one again. There's bird. There's Dan. Bird and Dan. Dan and Bird. See, it is bigger. I knew I could, I could tell it felt a little bit taller, that car. So let's, let's just look at some centering here. So this one's a little OC, but I mean, it's from 1954 for Pete's sakes. Very cool. Very cool card. 
All right, here's your rookie, Dan Hampton rookie from 1981. Thanks for reminding me. We'll go ahead and get you squared up in that, Robert. I hope you do. I hope you do win it, my man. We appreciate you. We appreciate you coming to the site. We appreciate you spending time with us. We got appreciate you. Appreciate you. You got the first two spots locked You're up. going for the... You're not making a wrong decision on 88 Fleer Box, I'll tell you that. No. Not at all. I mean, <clears throat> every set, every single one that's come out of this box has looked like this just about... It's, it's a matter of this this bottom line being the, the same thickness as these two. Yeah, I mean, that, uh, those ones we pulled the other day were all just jaw droppers. The only, the only problem that I saw with it was that one little fish, that that crazy hairline on the... Yeah, on the, the Aguirre. Yeah, and that was only on two of them, and we pulled four. So, go figure. Oh, don't forget. MJ... And Dave Parker. Um, what did he get? What did he get? Did he get two spots or three spots in the giveaway? We got, uh, we got him for two. Two spots, Robert. Uh, uh, what are they up for? Hundred, hundred pop. I mean, you, we can give him another one. Tell you what, Robert. Mother, we we round up. Tell you what, Robert. We round up around here, my man. You're in there three times for the mantle. Keep hanging out with us, and we'll uh, you'll win that you'll win that baby before you know it. <laughs> All right, so um, all right, yeah, give him three. I like it. And just like that, there's 27 spots left. All right, where are we at? Did, are we all caught up? I think we're caught up, yep. Right on. Are right, you? Mint 15 for 15% 15 15 off. off. Tonight only. We're going to turn it off tonight. <laughs> Robert, we appreciate you, buddy. We mm -hmm. really do. That, uh, that bird's nice, too. Gee whiz. That's a nice card. Yeah, the bird says, uh, PSA says 100 for a bird 9. I think you get nine, don't you think? I mean, quick glance, it looked real, it looked good. Top to bottom was the only thing I saw f at first glance. It does get roasting in here. We need a little fan, a little quiet fan or something. Yeah, that's cool. Um, let's see you guys is Robert still hanging around hey Robert if you're still hanging here, if here's one that's a little bit more center I'll, we'll throw this one in there too let's put it in a new sleeve though <clears throat> yeah we got your wheel spins that was uh, your 81 football and 89 Fleer an extra pack yeah. of 89 Fleer basketball and then we kicked you an extra pack of 18 Bowman Draft and rounded you up on the on the giveaway. Right, we're giving it all away, Robert. Bang. I'm throwing that one in there, too. That, one's, that one is as close as she's getting, I think. That's a Chuckster. Are you going to throw that on his ball? Yeah, that's... Here's his big ones. That one's closed. I tried to, I was looking for a, a Chicago Bear, but that one will work. I didn't see any more. Which one did he say he didn't have in his collection? Oh, it was Jordan. It was Jordan, 89. Yeah, Robert, thank you, man. Yeah, buddy. I'll get you another one for the collecting. Over here. That Bowman was a cool one, man. That's a that's a 
that's a crap shoot you never know what's going to be in there i mean that was that's old that gum didn't even last it was like pulverized in the pack let me make sure I put that other psa pack up you didn't see it around did you um the this one oh yeah that one i saw somebody open one up a different way the other day and it, maybe we've been opening them up the wrong way You like take a screwdriver to it and kind of knock this piece out. Which one? Like here. Like you stick a screwdriver in there instead of doing the. I just you start when you start sticking the screwdriver around there. It makes me nervous. All right, Robert. Thanks, buddy. We appreciate you, man. We appreciate you hanging out with us, and we'll see you next time. We'll, we'll get you some more fire. Fire cards, man. We appreciate you. We're just looking at this, talking about how um, there's a different way of opening it right there. Yeah, thanks, Robert. Take it easy at work, man. Yeah, no doubt. Where's he at? Is Break he out west? Shift. Is he out west? Um, I thought he was up in uh, Indiana. I thought. Oh, yeah, I guess he is. Nice. He's out there. Doing that graveyard. All right, well, let's keep it live, running live, and we'll uh, stay live a little bit longer. We got a little bit of time here, guys. We appreciate everybody tuning in tonight. It's been a good run. We got a, uh, we got our new, uh, our new video. Speaking of, should we blast them with a new video? Yeah. Nah, we'll wait. All right, guys. Um, <laughs> we'll take a break. We'll be back in about 20 minutes or so. We'll keep an eye on it, guys. Uh, any questions, drop it in the chat, and we're here. Website should be relatively up to date. we got 27 spots left in the mail giveaway. Uh, we got new products, new stuff coming in daily, more Bowman baseball, good stuff. Appreciate it, guys. We're here. ClassicPackBreaks.com. We'll uh, we'll be here. Mint fifteen for another hour or so. Yeah, Ryan's lost it. He's lost his mind. Mint fifteen, fifteen percent off the website. <laughs>